Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be back filming videos. I haven't really put much effort into my videos over the past, I would say, I would say since I started uni I haven't really put as much effort into my videos as I used to do and I don't know I just haven't really had as much passion for my YouTube channel but I'm gonna get back in it I'm gonna do some more videos I've got loads of video ideas coming up different ones things I haven't done before but this is something that I have definitely done before so I am just gonna be doing my July my July glossy box unboxing if you don't know what glossy box is it is a monthly subscription where basically you will get sent a box every month full of like five or six products in it sometimes and it's worth a lot more than what you pay for it the box is 10 pounds and you do also have to pay postage as well but I personally think that this kind of thing is worth it for me because I I'm the kind of person that before I had this subscription want to try new makeup I want to try different things I want to try things to kind of use on my channel but also just day-to-day -day life and I never ventured out because things would be too expensive or I didn't want to take the risk and this just means that you get to try things that you wouldn't usually try and also it saves you spending money and wasting it on things that you haven't tried before because this if you know you like something in this box then you can always rebuy it afterwards also I am going to be linking down every single product that I talk about in this box so every single product in this box I'm going to link in the description if you want to go and buy it I'm going to try and do that a lot more in my videos because I know that it's helpful if you want to so that's what I'm going to be doing so check out the description box but without further ado let's crack on with the video I am also extremely warm right now but I thought I'd wear this jumper because it matches my headband so there we go so this month in my glossy box this is what it looks like this is just what the glossy box always looks like it always looks like this unless it's a theme for example if it was easter or valentine's or something like that then they would change the look of the box but if we unbox it and open it so just a quick disclaimer i have already opened this box i already unboxed it i've been trying the products for a week and i wanted to do that so that i could kind of give a kind of first impression slight review of them in this video there's going to be kind of cutaway clips of me trying the products on and you know just showing the products up close because again like i said i want to put more effort into my video so yeah i'm just going to discuss the products tell you the prices tell you all about it and that's done so the theme of this month is holiday so it says glossy box holiday haul and it just gives you kind of like a little list of all the products and information about them so i'll go through that now so the first product in the box which i'm actually quite pleased i got because i'm actually running out with my current one is a cleanser so this is the cleansing foam from oma Ravitsa. oma Ravitsa? I think that's right. Most of these brands I have actually never heard of before. And this is a cleansing foam. So when you rub it into your hands and you rub it on your face, it does actually foam up with water. So wet your face first, then rub this onto your face, rub it in and it does actually foam up. And it does smell very interesting. Like I would say that it's not the greatest smell. It smells very herbally and I don't know if I'm, you know, here for that kind of smell, um, but it's not too bad. So yeah, it, it's all right. This is the travel size, which is worth £18. So that's quite a lot of money for a cleanser, in my opinion. Whereas the full size version of this product is worth £52. It says it is a travel size cleanser. It's a holiday must have created by a Hungarian brand, Oma Ravitska. It boasts a patented healing concentrate system that he that harnesses the curing powers of Budapest's famous spas this cleanser not only removes makeup and impurities but it energizes and revitalizes your skin perfect after a day spent in the sun so yeah do actually quite like that so far can't really give too much a review but it might end up in the favorites video the next product is this which i was actually very happy to get this is a tanning product and i kind of ran out of my tanning product recently and i want to try new ones i want to see which ones work best and i did just kind of patch test this slightly on my wrist just to see if it was any good and i, I think it is good but i am going to obviously try it on my body i haven't had chance to do that yet but i will let you know in future videos but this is just a kind of a cheaper one this is the palmer's natural bronze body lotion i got the one in the shade dark i think 
I think so. Anyway, so basically what it says about this is it says, even if you aren't jetting off somewhere sunny, you can still flaunt a natural looking sun kiss glow thanks to these easy to use and deeply moisturizing gradual tanners. Simply apply, apply your lotion once a day. Remember to wash your hands after applying it. That is where I always go wrong. And gradually build your tan over a few days. So it's kind of like a gradual buildable tan. These are the ones that I really like. I'm not a massive fan of instant tans because they tend to kind of just kind of rub off, wash off, get everywhere, make my hands really dark. Whereas gradual tans just look so much more natural. They last longer and I just so much prefer them. So I, I'm excited to try this. The travel size, which is what I've got in my hand right now, is worth £2.49, whereas the full size would be worth £5.99, which I personally think is not too much money for a tan, especially if it's going to be a good one, but I will let you know. The next thing in this month's box was the Moroccan oil, Moroccan oil treatment. So Moroccan oil is the brand and it is kind of like a hair treatment. So this is what it looks like when you open it up. I have currently got a hair oil anyway from mark hill and that is really nice but it'll be interesting to see how this kind of compares to that one i've used this a couple of times i actually used it yesterday and today and when i used it today that's the try on clip that you'll see in this video the cutaway clip but i it does make my hair extremely soft like right now my hair is so soft i did try and curl it a little bit but because my hair is so soft it doesn't necessarily hold the curls that well so that's why it's not the curliest of hair right now but that's all due to kind of how soft my hair is which is really nice if you're the kind of person that has kind of like dry hair and it doesn't you know you're struggling to brush through it going for a hair oil is i would say essential because sometimes my hair can be so dry that i can't put a comb through it and when i do it pulls your hair out and you don't want that to happen so i tend to put this in my hair when my hair is kind of wet but not too wet and also then when it's dry as well so it kind of soaks it up as your hair dries and then also when your hair is dry so yeah i like this so far but again i haven't used it enough to kind of tell you but i do already think i prefer this to my mark hill one because the mark hill one is a bit greasier and it makes my hair feel greasy whereas this doesn't make your hair feel greasy it makes your hair feel just soft so yeah, and what it says about this is it says, it's a blending antioxidant, rich argan oil with shine boosting vitamins. This multi-purpose hair oil is a holiday essential. It not only protects and rescues sun damaged hair, but it works as a conditioning, styling and finishing tool. Use it to nourish damp hair before blow drying. That's just what I said. Or apply it to dry locks to smooth frizz and fly away. So I do both of those. This is the travel size, but it's still a very, very decent size. Like for me, I, it will take me absolutely ages to get through this. This is £13.45, so not the cheapest again. And the full size is, which is 100 mils by the way, for a full size is £31.85. So it's not the cheapest of products. Um, and that's what I like about these boxes. I like the fact that you get to try kind of more expensive things that I wouldn't usually buy. Next up, second to last, we have this, which is a mascara. I was so happy to see this mascara because I'm the kind of person that I really don't like buying mascaras. I just feel like I wanna get the cheapest one and I never venture out for a more expensive one because I feel like they're not gonna be worth the money. But I, that's why I like to try these. So yeah, very happy with this one. This is from Mana Cador Cosmetics. Mana Cador Cosmetics, don't know, haven't heard of it. And this is called the Bloom Mascara. And it says, when you've got a gorgeous golden tan, sometimes the only makeup you need is a touch of mascara to make your eyes pop. Boasting is boasting a cutting edge wand with ultra dense bristles this mascara will give you longer and fuller looking lashes better yet its hydrating formula ensures a clump and flake free finish i do actually really like this i've been using it for the past week so kind of five to six days i've been using this for and i do really like it it is a lot better than mascaras that i've tried previously that are a lot cheaper would i say it's worth the money because this is 23 pounds if this is the full size by the way i don't know i don't think it's worth 23 pounds in my opinion not for me anyway not for my lashes it's not doing enough to justify that amount of money but for some people that's got that money to spend then they probably will really like it i also really like the packaging it's kind of like twisted um it puts a lot of product onto your um lashes which i really really like it's a nice kind of bristle um, rather than a plastic applicator just means that my lashes I don't know it just applies really really nicely and yeah this is in the shade jet black by the way 
um, just to let you know. So I do really like that at the minute and I'm so glad that that was in the box. That might be my favourite thing, I'm not sure. Then finally, just a very simple thing here. This is the Tea Tree and Witch Hazel Peel Off and Charcoal Face Mask. So there was either a peel off mask or a charcoal one and I got the peel off one because as you can see here, there was two that you could get, this one or this one. This one says, say hello to your fresh and healthy summer glow. Infused with soothing tea tree oil and calming witch hazel, both these face masks remove dirt and impurities from your pores. Whether you receive the peel off mask or the charcoal one, you'll have clearer and brighter skin looking in just 15 minutes. Brighter looking skin in just 15 minutes. This is worth a pound. So this is the travel size, which is worth a pound. The full size is worth £3.50. I obviously haven't tried this yet, so I can't really give a review of it, but I am going to be using it in the bath tonight. So I will do a little try on clip for you later on, um, which you will see in this video, but I haven't done it just yet. And I will also insert a clip of me talking about how um, I like it, if I like it or not. So I'll insert that now. Okay, so I've just got the face mask on. It actually smells really nice like this smell takes me back to like four years ago when i tried out the whole um boots which hazel and tea tree products back when i used to have acne my skin is a lot better now i know it doesn't look the greatest right now but it's because i just used a facial scrub so everything will just kind of show up but yeah so far it's very interesting i haven't used one like this before it's meant to be a peel off mask so i'll check back with you in 15 minutes and see if it does peel off right i'm just about to peel the mask off it looks horrific wow it looks so weird let's see how it goes oh my god it's peeling off well this is weird oh my god this is weird wow let me peel this off the top oh my god this peels off so well like it does not leave back anything my skin feels nice it doesn't feel like it's one of those peel off masks where it pulls um impurities out your face because i have some peel off masks that i literally peel off and i can literally see um kind of stuff that's been pulled out of my skin i don't feel like that does that um but my skin does feel really nice and soft so yeah i really like that it peels off so nice if you're the kind of person that likes peeling off things you'll really like that so yeah winner winner that is everything in my glossy box for july i do really really like everything i think my favorite thing is the mascara definitely then it is the facial wash then it's probably the tan um then it's these two the hair oil and the face mask joint because i do love a good face mask i'm not gonna lie i do really love a good face mask but overall everything is really really good and i'm excited to see what is in next month's Still got the subscription it, there is a sneak peek on the back of here as to what is going to be in next month so if you've got this subscription and you don't want to see what's in next month then click off the video now so august it says it's our birthday next month and we're making this special occasion the only way we know how with pink sparkles and glitter to celebrate we'll be treating you to your favorite brands and top picks including huda beauty strobing metallic lip gloss a light rose hue with gold reflections the lip gloss will add a touch of shimmer and shine to your pout so it looks like this so it's this kind of lip glossy thing here shimmery lip gloss so that's what i'm going to get next month so that is my glossy box unboxing thank you for watching i will link down these products in the description if i can find them all so go and check out the description for everything and I will also link down my glossy box playlist because I have done unboxings in previous months and I put it into a playlist. So I'll link that down below if you want to go and see what I got in the previous months. But yeah, obviously, if you want to try out glossy box subscription, then you can try that out as well online. Just go onto their website. I will link their website down below as well. And you can just go and subscribe to that if you want. And get products every month because it is really really exciting so thanks for watching this video give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and please do subscribe because i'm going to be putting a lot more effort into my videos from now on so yeah i'll see you in my next one goodbye